ourselves a little bit, but you know, at the end of the day, we are making and learning, okay, ascending to a higher frequency so i want to thank you guys so so much welcome back please also feel free to like share subscribe turn on the notifications if you haven't done so already if you are in the his house okay baby so i also have my products and services that are on my website i have my yoni soaps yoni steams manifesting manifesting oils love oils self-love oils prosperity clarity protection oils as well sage palisanto sticks yoni steam seeds yoni steams um, yoni soaps, sugar scrubs, body butters, all that good stuff. All that information will be in the description box below. All right, Pisces. <clears throat> January 2021. Thank you. What are the messages? Sun, moon, rising, Mars, Mercury, Venus. Thank you. What are the messages? Thank you. Pisces collectively January 2021 for that bag. Okay, let's see what's going on. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. What are the messages? Let's for my Pisces, what are the messages? January 2021. What are the messages for my Pisces collectively? All right, collectively Pisces, January 2021. Alright, so I have three of Raphael here. So I'm getting three through three. You guys can also be um, having conversations. Okay. You guys can be seeing three through three. A lot of you guys can be celebrating during this time. This can also be the by the 3rd of January. This can also be by the, by the 13th or by the 23rd. Okay. I definitely feel like a lot of you guys can be happy. This is celebrating a new job. Okay. Some of you guys can also be, um, and invited to some type of um this is like business gathering okay relaunch business launch this is like a party okay a grand opening because we're talking about work here so this also this has to do with like um a community like a work community powwow or this can be like a happy hour or something of that nature but this is a celebration you guys can also be celebrating a new job or celebrating the fact that you got a job or celebrating something okay in the workplace here <clears throat> unity so like i said you guys can be around people this can also be co-workers here friends family friends that are like family is also what i'm hearing co-workers that you feel like are like family you guys can also be feeling connected okay like you are with people i see into you see it you see into me some of you guys this is also like a re reconciliation because the three of cups i'm also getting some of you guys can also be reconciling with somebody reconciling with someone when it comes to their work you guys can be speaking to somebody at their job here or meeting somebody at their job or speak like I'm getting messages, text messages, phone calls. You're meet, you're meeting, or you're expressing how you feel. A connection, family member, lover. Um, love. I definitely feel like if this is a work environment, you guys are feeling like family, or you guys are really loving, nurturing, caring. Okay, you guys will look out for one another as well. <coughs> I'm also getting if this is a group here. If this is a group, I definitely feel like um, by the third, the by the third, the third week of January, the thirteenth, there may be some type of um, like someone from this from this group of friends is gonna go because you see how there's two now, there's three and there's two. So that's why I feel like I feel like there might be some type of conflict or there's some there might be some type of situation back and forth when it comes to these three females, these three males here, when it comes to money, when it comes to contracts, agreements, or what they've agreed to or whatever the case may be. Because it went from three to two. So somebody left here. Someone got an attitude. Someone um, felt like they were being unappreciated, not valued, okay, or something of that nature. Someone may have found something new or it's like someone didn't feel like they fit in. Someone also may have felt like they weren't part of the group, whether this is you or somebody else. <clears throat> so, yeah, 
I definitely feel like you guys are not really listening to your intuition here. You guys, this is like I said, two, two, twos, okay? Two, two, twos, you got the three, threes. Talks about structure, balance, relationships. This talks about, like I said, your creativity, like your co collaborations, partnerships, contracts, agreements, okay? You guys can be asking yourself whether you want to stay or go in a situation here because a lot of you guys are indecisive you guys don't know which way you want to go you guys don't know if you want to stay with this this job or go with this one you guys don't know if you want to break free from this friendship and go into that one or whatever the case may be okay there's a need for you guys to make an indecision there's a need for you guys to make a decision excuse me instead of being indecisive all right <clears throat> Some of you guys are, okay, some of you guys are going to be feeling imbalanced here or there's a need for you guys to temper your emotions when it comes to a family dynamic or some type of, a, some type of plan of a family business or this can be a friend business or collaborating with a friend or like I said, a family member here. You could be feeling imbalanced here. You can also be feeling like someone is not, uh, you or someone else is not doing all that they can do to bring something to the highest potential. in this contract or in this family business here there's some type of plan that is like a poor plan that resulted in you becoming angry somebody becoming angry or this this could have been 60 to 600 uh dollars that was lost here in january is what i'm getting pisces Okay, I do feel like you, I'm, I'm hearing some of you guys are saying like, you don't know how to manage money or you're telling someone that they don't know how to manage money. Someone's telling you that you don't know how to manage money. This could be your mom, your dad, this can be a child's mother, child's father, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your sister, um, a friend, someone like that. I'm also getting that you guys can be defensive here and there's a need for you guys to rest, okay? Some of you guys may not be wanting to rest. Some of you guys are really upset that you guys lost a lot of money. You guys can be very combative here. You guys can be upset that you lost some type of competition or it's like your application was forthrown or it's like someone's not even looking at you. Someone's not even paying attention to you. This could be a family, a friend, a former friend, or a former um, lover as well. I feel like there was a lot of people involved in the situation and you feel defeated, okay? I'm also getting that this was conflict, backstabbing, or someone like you're trying to turn a lot of people against um, someone here. Like if you tried to do this seven months ago, seven, seven months ago, people Pisces and this happened seven weeks ago, seven months ago, okay? I feel like now in January, you're going to have conflict conflict combats like you're arguing with a lot of people co-workers bosses things are also boomerang back for you for the turmoil that you put on somebody else <clears throat> yeah they didn't want me to say that but i'm clearing my throat and i'm gonna keep it pushing so like i said those shockers speak your truth pisces i definitely feel like the seven of wands you guys are feeling like you're having to like this is like i, I feel like someone I feel like you guys are feeling honestly defeated. Like, you guys feel like a lot of people are involved in the situation. I feel like you're also feeling like, why is this happening right now? Like, why is this happening to me? That's really what I'm getting, Pisces. But I feel like a lot of this is happening again because of some type of decision or some type of, this could have been magic or communication that was said. Like I said, it was a group thing. This could have been five to seven five to nine different people this could have been females males this could have been mixed this could have been like i said magic spell work or some type of communication whatever that was spoke spoken about one person i just feel like it's boomeranging back karma is coming eight of pentacles yeah there's a whole bunch of losses here okay or this is like you're not wanting to work on a b and c your ideas are going low your energy is going low you're tired you could be getting sick your focus is all over the place like i said your money's being lost or you're having to have all these unexpected payouts part of me feel like pisces you guys were in part of a group this could have been a cult a coven this could have been a friendship this could have been a like i said a group of people group of friends or something like you were a part of something here where you were chastising dogging somebody out or being um using ill intent using using your A weapon instead of something to enlighten and empower i feel like you guys were grouping with other people 
I was high vibing, minding their business and doing what they were supposed to do. They could have been a former lover, a former friend or someone that you know. Okay, I definitely feel like regards to that, this is why your stagnancy is happening when it comes to your money or the things around you. Whoever is involved with you, I, like I said, Pisces, this is happening in their life too. So I feel like you and all these group of people, you guys are all having karma or... <clears throat> Again, they're not wanting me to say it, but I'm going to say it anyways, Pisces. Um, things are happening, like I said, divine time and divine corner. Karma is being karma is being passed around, whether you like it or not. Because I feel like a lot of you guys were either involved in situations, this could have been bosses, co-workers, friends, group, environments, whatever the case may be, that wasn't conducive, that wasn't um, growing you. Okay, this was gossip or, like I said, magic and intent trying to stop somebody's shine or slow somebody's um, power abilities or stop their money. I feel like whatever you or that group that you were involved in put on that person is now boomerang back to you. So all I'm going to say this is, look, don't cry. Don't pray. Don't get mad when things start happening to you, Pisces. Don't get angry when spirit and ancestors start showing out because you don't do things to God children. You don't do things to God child. All right. So that's really what I'm getting. If this isn't you, Pisces, then like I said, I, listen, I just read the energy. A lot of this energy, some of you guys are doing this. Others of you, I feel like this um, heavy energy is just, like I said, environments, people, friends, lovers, okay? And for a strong majority of you, you guys are kind of still in that lower vibrational energy where you guys are still trying to either blame others or you guys are trying to look for a fault, in something because you guys know that you need to either a apologize or b say whatever you need to say so overall i just feel like pisces in january 2021 is about to be a roller coaster karma is about to begin passed around like i said if you're somebody's like uh mother father son friend brother whatever the case may be former friend cousin sister Mother, father, whatever the case, spirit is about to be, spirit is about to show you exactly what. Wanting to see it, a lot of you guys thought that people were telling, the, telling lies or trying to make up stuff, but you guys are really going to see karma work. Whether you're on the side of receiving, reaping the karma, or whether you're on the side of um, seeing other people reap their karma. A lot of you guys, whoever's watching this video, I feel like a lot of you guys are going to be seeing yourselves reap the karma. Um, and you guys will be in prayer and repenting and realizing that the actions that you guys may have done the last 12 months, 12 weeks, or two, this could have been at least to 12 different people, the actions that you guys were doing um, now you're having to pay for it spiritually, ancestors. Some of you guys can also be being closed off from spiritual spirituality, like prayers, um, getting guidance, okay? This is like your ancestors. Some of you guys, your ancestors or spirit guides, they're leaving you. They're not giving you, they're not giving you some type of, um, insight, wisdom. Others of you, there's a need for you guys to pray more. There's a need for you guys to pick up the Bible. There's a need for you guys to know God, know Jah, know Allah, okay? Know your ancestors, know your spirit guides more, Okay, because I feel like it just depends on where you are at. But Pisces, again, a lot of you that I've been reading for, a lot of you guys are going to be reaping that karma because whatever ill intent, whatever magic, whatever jealousy, envy, or lower vibrational energy that you guys were trying to put on another person either last year in 2018 or whatever the case may be, it's boomerang back. And that's really what I got. Peace, love, and light. I love you. I love myself.